Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to solve the system of equation by Gauss elimination method. This given equation should be written as a product of the matrices. So we have to take all the coefficients of x, y and z which is 2, minus 1, 3, minus 1, 2, 1, 3, 1, minus 4. So this is a matrix A. And this when we multiply with another column matrix which is having the elements x, y, z and equating to another column matrix we get back the equation. So the given equation is written as the product of matrices. So this is of the form A x equal to B. Now using this we have to write the augmented matrix A comma B. This augmented matrix A comma B is nothing but combining both A and B. So first column is 2 minus 1 3 then minus 1 2 on the second column then we have third column and fourth column it has the constant. So to separate this we just put a small line here. So this is the augmented matrix AB and this augmented matrix AB should be converted as a upper triangular matrix. So this lower triangular elements we have to make it as 0. So first thing we are going to make this minus 1 as 0 for that we have to do row 2 gives row 2 but we take 2 times of that. So when I multiply this 2 we get minus 2. When I add with row 1 element which is 2 we get 0. So I am going to do this row operation to make this as 0. In the same way R3 also I take this R3 but this is 3 and this is 2. So the LCM of 3 and 2 is 6. So I have to take 2 times of R3 with that 3 times of R1 if I subtract that becomes 0. So now this augmented matrix as per the row operation first row we are not doing anything so it is written as it is. Second row 2 times of this added with R1. So minus 2 plus 2 it becomes 0. When I multiply this with 2 it becomes 4. 4 minus 1 3. Then when I multiply this with 2 then add with this it becomes 5. When I multiply 2 with this it is 8. 8 plus 8 16. Similarly 2 times of this is 6 minus 3 times of this is again 6 so it is 0. Then 2 times of this will be 2 and I have to take minus 3 times of this so it becomes plus 3 totally this is 5. Then minus 8 when I multiply this with 2 times with minus 3 into 3 9 so it is minus 17 and here it is 0 minus 3 times gives minus 24. So we completed this row operation for the augmented matrix AB. Now we made these two elements 0. Now this element I have to make 0. For that I have to do row 3 operation. So I take row 3 and I am going to use this 3. So the LCM for these two numbers is 15. So 3 times of this row 3 I am subtracting with 5 times of row 2. So now the augmented matrix first row is written as it is. Even second row is written as it is. Now coming to third row this is 3 into R3 minus 5 into both are 0 so it is 0 here. Now when I multiply this with 3 it is 15 minus 5 into 3 is 15 so this is 0. In the same way 3 into minus 17 minus 5 into 5. So this gives minus 51 minus 25. So totally minus 76. And here 3 into 
minus 24 minus 5 into 16. This gives minus 72 minus 80. So totally this is minus 152. So we completed the matrix. We converted into upper triangular matrix where the elements present only in the upper triangle. Now we are going to use back substitution method. So we are going to take this part z times of this minus 76 is equal to minus 152. From this if I divide we get minus 152 divided by 76. So it is actually 2 times. Then coming to the previous row it is 3 times of y 3y plus 5z equal to 16. Already we know z value. So 3y plus 5 into 2 equal to 16. This is 10. So 3y plus 10 equal to 16. Now 3y equal to 16 minus 10. So 3y equal to 6 and y equal to 6 by 3 which is 2. Then coming to the first row, we take this 2x minus y, 2x minus y plus 3z equal to 8. Now 2x minus 2 plus 6, we substituted y and z which is 8. This is actually 4. When I take to the other side, it becomes minus 4. So 2x equal to 4. From this x is equal to 4 by 2 which is 2. So we got the value of x, y and z.